Warning. Warning. UFO detected. game but it's a beauty it's one of the best games I've ever played full of strategy and extremely hard even when you're a beginner if you're wondering why I chose I've already failed recording this once and so I'm just gonna make a base I would start off Games are all about strategy and building things and researching things. So what I'm gonna start off doing is this is like the uh, setup screen. You uh, build your bases. You patrol the earth for alien scum, and you uh, do all sorts of other such things. But anyway, first things we want to do: get these things up and running. Stuff we really want to build early on. We start off with a bunch of money. First thing you want to do is buy 10 soldiers and 12 scientists. And I also want to purchase 10 electro flares and 2 stunt rods. That sounds good. So we've just started basic. Actually, no, we gotta equip craft first. So here's what's gonna go on our ship, our Sky Ranger, which we send into battle. I want to just take off everything to start off because a lot of this stuff is junk. Like, I hate the heavy cannon and the auto cannon. It's like super inaccurate and super bad. But, anyway, so I'm going to put on some pistols, some rifles, and a rocket launcher for our guys to use. The main gameplay of this game is like a sort of strategic, turn based uh, RTS sort of. It's pretty uh, interesting. I'll have to show you, but. We're just going to have the time go by by an hour at a time. You can sort of only see this area around here. We just arrived. We have uh, just had some merchandise arrive. A stun rod and an electro flare. And I'm going to put those on our ship. Just in case the electro flares, they let me see when it's night time out. And uh, the stun rods, you only put one of on. I might as well put two on. But they, uh, they let me see... Uh, the insides of aliens when I uh, capture them alive and check them out when they're alive. I should not have gone into one near there. We just passed by like four days. It's Monday, the 4th of January, 1999. Uh, we are, we just had all our soldiers arrive at our base. Okay. okay. I'm pretty sure my scientists have also arrived then in that case. And I want to get these laser weapons up as fast as possible. They're pretty important. Because the starter weapons, they suck. But anyway, let's continue. We have a lot of people on here. I'm going to take them all off, actually, temporarily. And we can go through quickly. What all our troops are like. Let's see what we're going to do. Let's go soldiers. Check through all of them. Let's see. So yeah, scroll through and see if any have really good time units. Because it means they have potential. Virgil. He has, he has, um, he has potential. Let's call him, uh, let's just call him, uh, Virgil. We just need to specify that he is the highest quality of our units, so. Doesn't seem anyone else. Here's Boris. Let's call him Boris uh, Petrov. And Petrov. And his. I'm gonna give him a nickname. Boris V. 
the bear. That's not a good nickname. I'm pretty sure he just sucks right now. Let me see. Who has the most health? Boris the bear actually has the most health. So, other than Shukti. But I guess that's going to be his name then. Boris the bear. Petrov. Oh, I can't fit that in. I just put Boris the bear. So we're just gonna get set up this episode, ready for some pain. You'll be Virgil. Are you brave? Uh, Virgil's. No, this guy is brave. Let's call him Braveheart. Let's call him Yoko Mora Brave. Put that in. I guess you're just gonna be Lloyd. Lloyd. Roy. <laughs> Let's just call you Louis. Who's what? Where do I just name her something else? <laughs> Sorry about this. Man. Mans. Or ladies. Whatever. Let's see if I can get in here like. Let's call her Ohm. Really Ohm. And anyone else good here? I mean, one that stands out. Someone who can run it really fast seems like a good uh, thing. Shiguru. Uh, let's call him Shiguru. Uh, uh, watch it. Usain Bolt. <laughs> but anyway. So I'm just naming these guys because it's sort of important to know who to arm up well. It's sort of a hassle. But it's nice to know. It always it always helps. Uh, so you're going to be Virgil. Virgil. Pew. Pew. Let's call you. Virgil Gorb. There we go. So these are our. These are gonna be our main units. Actually, someone with good firing accuracy. Uh, I know who always has good luck. It's good firing accuracy. Ryan. Master. Brother of other Ohm. Brother of Lily Ohm. Anyone else? And who is the strongest? This is Nikolai Petrov. And this is. This is strong. Ajax, Von Gut, Guten, Von. There we go. Guten, Von. And who else here is pretty neat? There's two Sujis. That's pretty interesting. Let me 
he could have a grenadier. Gaston. Let's call him. Bombard. No, that's his nickname. Let's call him Boris Bombard. Boris Bombard Biff, Virgil Pew Pew Gorb, uh, Lily Braveheart Ohm, Ajax von Gutenwurm, Nikolai Petrov, Boris Bear Petrov, Ryan Master Ohm, and Usain Bolt. Okay, those are our guys, our main, our mains. So, what we want to do is now equip our craft with our finest soldiers which will be Ajax you want to put these people at the front Usain Bolt Nikolai Petrov and so all those guys are going on and a bunch of other randoms are going on okay Sujis aren't going on in this mission it looks like but that'll be the end of episode one. It's pretty boring. I'm sorry about that, but uh, <laughs> gotta start off somewhere, right? Well, I'll see you in the next episode. Don't get abducted.